And it doesn't look like we're going to get any rain here anytime soon either. Yeah, but those are some yeah. scary stats, though. Then. Yeah, they were, yeah. When you think about the droughts we had the past three years, pretty scary, right? And January is typically one of our wettest months or the wettest month for us, as well as the Bay Area. Just not happening this week. We have a storm moving their direction, but we have plenty of sunshine and that storm is going to miss us completely. Our shot from our downtown sky cam looking out toward the Coronado Bridge. High thin clouds up overhead. That's about it. Nice shot over Poway as well. Uh, uh, highs today came up quite a bit from yesterday. We talked about a nice warm up and look at that great shot from Matt Woodson looking off to the southwest. All right, at this hour, we're at 70 in Escondido, 68 in Poway, St. for Kearney Mesa. We got to about 67 now at Limburg and right along the coast mid 60s. Highs today were in the mid 70s, though. You could feel it out there as the temperatures were coming up and we had plenty of sunshine. At this hour, running three to seven degrees above where we were this time yesterday and we'll stay right about here for a couple of days. Yeah, we've got a light sea breeze coming on here. Very, very light, but for the higher elevations, you can see the offshore wind coming on through and that's going to be the story for us most of this week ahead. They're not strong offshore winds. You can see only 10 to 15 miles per hour at best during the afternoon as we look at wind future cast. All right, here's the satellite and radar. There we are. You can see the storm track moving up into the Pacific Northwest. However, Big area of high pressure setting up and that's going to act as a roadblock and send those storms up and over us. So we're not going to get any rain. In fact, all that's going to do is give us those very weak offshore winds, keep temperatures up again. So a warm week ahead. In fact, our highs for the inland locations remaining about five to 10 degrees above average right along the coast, very close to average. And this is not going to budge a whole lot. It'll move around a little bit, but most of the week it's going to be in place. We'll just see some of those high thin clouds tomorrow. So with the dry air in place and lack of cloud cover, we'll drop to 39 in Escondido, 37 in Poway, 29 in Ramona. Highs tomorrow mid 70s, Point Loma 72, 76 in Poway, over to Ranch Bernardo about 75, Santee you're about 77. Low 70s right along the coast and we'll manage some upper 60s right along the coast as well. 74 for Valley Center, 75 in Fallbrook, across the deserts we continue with mid 70s. Mount Laguna tomorrow, pretty nice out there as well. And Julian will manage some 50s to near 60 degree weather. Seven day forecast for the coast, mainly in the upper 60s to lower 70s with overnight lows in the 40s and 50s and a little bit of cloud cover as we go through next weekend. But overall, no rain. Your seven day forecast for the inland locations, close to 80 on Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, continuing uh, with the dry, sunny weather on Saturday and Sunday as well. Looks like uh, even the mountains, for our mountains, plenty of sunshine, only 60s. And our deserts continue with temperatures close to 80 degrees. Again, 5 to 10 degrees above normal for this time of year. Boy, I wish I had rain in the forecast after we heard those stats, but we don't. Yeah. So enjoy the sunshine, right? Still Suddenly I want it. I know. <laughs> I know. <Rhea. laughs> we love you.